What is going on guys, Andrew here, welcome back to On Feet. This is where I check out new and old sneakers, I unbox them, give my first impressions, and after that I show them off on feet. Today we're gonna to be checking out one of the most popular Adidas shoes, at least at this time, the Adidas Ultra Boost 22s. I actually was able to get the new colorway and they even had that one on sale. So it was $95 versus its original MSRP of $190. Let's go ahead and unbox these things. Okay, this is the box here. I like the box, they definitely switched up on me this time. I like the gray with the black, that goes hard. Let's go ahead and open it up. Let's see what we got here. Oh, okay, okay. I, I can't wait for y'all to see this. Y'all looked at the thumbnail already, but yo, these look fire. Check that out. Y'all see me wearing the pink rock and the pink today, but look at this gradient, it looks so cool. Look how it goes from that light pink it goes from like a hot pink to basically this like violet color it's really nice it looks great in person and when i saw it online i was like oh i gotta grab these this is a pair like i'll, I'll be surprised if people don't get a hold of more but i really like the way they look and check out the uh mid the midsole here it actually is no tongue to this shoe just to let you know there's no tongue i've been trying to get a pair of ultra boost 22 for the longest time by the way they do not have a size 11 even back then when i was trying to get them on sale they ran out of size 11 so fast for this shoe it's just a really popular size when it comes to really any running shoe mainly because they fit a little bit tighter and i literally just did a video on the 40 uh future crafts if you want to check those out uh just subscribe to the channel if you want to see some more videos like this like i said just hit that bell you can be notified as soon as i release the video you can barely see it on camera but the color on that is insane. Those were also a size 11, and so is this one. I went with a size 11 for this one as well, mainly because I've tried these on in store before, and I cannot wear a 10. I can't wear a 10 and a half. I have to wear an 11. The outer sole goes from basically pink to violet, kind of like how the actual midsole does. And I really like, look how much boost foam that is. That's a lot of boost foam in the back there. I wanted the all black ones so bad, but I cannot get them for under like $200, and I'm not going to pay that much for that pair of shoes when I could when I just got this for $95 like that'd be crazy that's what they look like I'm about to go ahead and try them on and let you all know how they feel on feet and then the insole says in plastic waste I don't know if you're going to be able to see that on camera or not and I'll actually try to even rip it out a little bit the insole is slightly different it is white with a nice little textured on the bottom and it also has the Adidas logo. That's a nice little Easter egg there. I don't know if y'all can pick that up or not. Uh, it does say, like I said, in plastic waste though. So that's a nice little touch. They've been putting that in a lot of their shoes and all their boxes. So it's nice to see that they are trying to help the environment. So yeah. Alrighty, so I got them on my feet now. And I must say, they fit like a glove, man. Like seriously, they are, they are actually pretty tight. I'm not going to lie. They do run small. They're narrow and very soft like but they do feel good on feet i will say you can definitely tell it's a running type of shoe the boost on this one feels more firm than one of my other pairs like the zx 2k boost 2.0s i know it's a crazy name but here they are this is them right here i got this olive green colorway uh but the boost on this one is way squishier um these are one of my most comfortable pairs honestly believe it or not like i don't talk about them a lot but they're very comfy and I really love the colorway on this. Uh, I actually wear them more often than you think. They're just a nice solid shoe to just wear out on a casual day. I do have a little scuff mark there, unfortunately. I just noticed that now. I'm gonna have to wipe that off or something. I gotta figure out how to get that off. Let's go over some of the highlights of the shoe. It says from problem to performance. Uh, this product is made in part with Parley Ocean Plastic. Just one of the innovations that represents our commitment to help in plastic waste. And we also have incredible energy return. Of course, you have your Boost midsole. And then we also have your Adidas LEP, which stands for Linear Energy Push System. The colorway on this is Core Black, Core Black Lucid Blue. So they didn't even call it pink. They called it Lucid Blue. Now I see why people buy the Ultra Boost 1.0s because they're a little bit squishier. And that's probably one of the most casual pair of shoes that they honestly have to offer. But it does come with a price. Like I said, almost all these shoes meant for running or comfort wise uh you're gonna pay to play for sure this running 190 it's hard for me to be like oh yeah go out and get it but with them being on sale how they are now at 95 dollars better grab a pair while you can they may not do this until later this year around black friday so hey if you're watching this in the future 
like to late 2023 or maybe like 2024 or something just know adidas is always putting stuff on sale so be sure to check their app maybe like once or twice a week so you can stay up to date. That's gonna do it for today's video. Let's go ahead and show these things off on feet. And until next time you guys, peace out.